Previously on Thrift Shop Divas, the ladies were asked to create a fashion show for the Working Women Survival Show. With a two-week deadline and only being able to use materials found at Goodwill, the ladies have been hard at work. Once upon a time, there was a group of gifted gals who met at the thrift shop, where each perfected their incredible craft. It's a good color. Hot pink. We're all making it up as we go along. Sassy. Voila. And when we brought them together for good, these ladies changed from lone do-it-yourselfers into thrift shop divas. That's where Goodwill comes in. They never know what they'll find, but they're crafting hope one thrift at a time. I'm so excited to see the dress, but I hope it fits. So we just got to the Working Women's Survival Show. I need to make sure that, hey, costume fits are all right. I've never been this close to a show and not actually seen the costume on someone before. Don't okay. tell me I get that white yes. one. Which one is yours? No, are you kidding? Oh my God, it's really beautiful yes, though. Yes, yes. This was actually I mean, a wedding dress that oh, I cut apart. And then there's this. You you're not look kidding when you so see a gorgeous. fairy princess. Yes. But it's a bad fairy princess, right? It's like Yeah, you're kind of like this like cross between a fairy princess and an evil queen. I couldn't make the fitting because I am a working woman. Go figure. <laughs> so I had to take my own measurements, which was a huge joke, and I hope I didn't really mess it up. Okay, Beth, this really kind of doesn't feel very secure, honey. No, I don't know for sure if these safety pins are going to hold. Well, you have to make them hold, because that's I'm literally, that would probably be my worst nightmare, Beth, yeah. is to be on stage and have my boobs fall no, out. We, we don't want that. I'm making some adjustments. I'm. It's not really fitting the way that, that I was hoping it would, um, but... You know, life is full of surprises and hopefully we're gonna make it work. Hey, we're gonna have the models get in their first outfits. So right now I'm just going through all the outfits and I'm like organizing them by models, making sure I have accessories for every single outfit, making sure like the shoes match the outfit because they literally are walking on the stage, walking back and they have to change within like a minute and a half. I put a second pin in the same spot. So if one pin fails, we have backup. God, I love you. <laughs> you are so good at what you do. Thank you. OK, let's go. All right, let's makeup. get you to makeup. Oh, my God. Wow. Early. I finished your Oh, my <laughs> Wow. Isn't it wonderful? It's totally not you, but I love it. <laughs> I am excited to see what Beth has come up with as far as an outfit for fantasy. But um, I am excited to see Naomi because she's putting her own outfit together. Boy, she can put so much great stuff together. I have seen the pieces that Naomi's gonna use, so I can't wait to see it. I cannot believe it's finally here. It's crazy. Like, we've done so much planning, and I don't even know how many times I've been to Goodwill back and forth, like, getting more outfits and getting more accessories, and so we'll see how it all comes together. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the Goodwill stage show. Are you guys familiar with Thrift Shop Divas? Okay. Well, this year, we have four fabulous women who are going to show you guys some fabulous finds, okay? So first, we have um, someone that's going to focus on fashion. She's going to show you how you can take $20 and have a complete outfit from the Goodwill. As a working mom, I really want women to know that you don't have to have a lot of time, for one, to look good, and you don't have to have a huge budget, you know? I mean, ev everyone is on a budget. Everyone loves to save money, no matter how fat your wallet is, you know? Um, everyone loves a good deal. So I really want women to know that you can look and feel good on a budget. And, you know, you, again, you don't have to have a lot of time. You don't have to go to, like, five different stores to get clothes for yourself, clothes for your kids, stuff for your home. Um, Goodwill has it all. So I really, really hope that women walk away with that. Now, we have this fabulous setup on the stage and all of these items were created by one of the divas. 
This particular diva has a little shop called Perennial, and what's really great about her shop is that she is environmentally friendly. So let's bring Jenny to the stage. Hey, how's it going? Hi. Hi, good to see you. Oh, it's so great to have you here. So we have some great things up here on the stage, and one of my favorites that you created is actually this vanity um, set. So I'm gonna let Jenny go ahead and take it away and tell us what she did. Yeah, so this piece was a great kind of simple project, and also to show you guys how easy it is to transform a Goodwill find with color. Adding a new color is gonna really make a totally new piece, but you don't even have to paint the whole thing, right? So this is a really simple project where we're only adding a dip of color on the legs and a dash around the line of the mirror. Um, and these two pieces are also originally separate, so we're combining two completely different things to create a vanity. So the, the vanists turned out great because they are simple, which is awesome to communicate to women that these are really simple projects, doesn't take a bunch of time or labor. Now, we're gonna talk about the fantasy part of Goodwill, because you can take individual pieces from Goodwill and create something that is out of this world. And this particular portion has been inspired by one of the divas. If you guys are Goodwill shoppers, you may have seen this particular diva in the Goodwill because she is something to see. So I'm gonna bring out to the stage Beth, who is a costume designer. I really hope that, that women take away a sense of, of confidence and a sense that anything is possible. Especially with Goodwill, it's like any anything that you want to do or create is totally within your reach. We are saving the best for last. Guys, this is Naomi. There is no such thing as uh, you can't be attractive because you don't have the money. That's not true. You can be attractive every day of your life if you want to be. I do housework in this. I run the vacuum sweeper in this if I want to, but it's up to me. It's my world, and I enjoy it. So this is Naomi, guys. Matter of fact, let's bring all of our divas out on the stage. I think um, we had great interaction between the divas and myself, and the crowd was really energized. So I'm happy. I think it was good. I'm relieved it's over, you know. <laughs> These are your first shot divas!